The Mannequin Item Number SCP-847 Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures SCP-847 is kept inside a locked room, reinforced with vanadium steel and concrete. In addition, SCP-847 must be kept chained up to at least four of the twelve electrically live hardpoints in the room at all times. These hardpoints are connected to a relay of backup generators that will activate in case of a power failure. Should these generators fail, or the chains become disconnected from the live hardpoints, Protocol SCP-847-E2 is to be enacted immediately, and to remain active until SCP-847 can be properly resecured. This is to be escalated to level E6 if the containment room is breached. All personnel posted to SCP-847 must be armed with containment device 29, a shock baton with internal charge of 30,000 volts. No female personnel are permitted within a 100 meter radius of SCP-847. Any female personnel found within this radius are to be incapacitated and removed from the area immediately. Description: SCP-847 resembles a human female mannequin. Researchers have been unable to determine if the missing pieces are due to injury, degradation, or attack. SCP-847 is normally dormant unless it is in close proximity to a human female. Experimentation has determined the radius of this effect to operate at around 50 to 100 meters. SCP-847 will animate under these circumstances and will make every attempt to reach the human female, exhibiting unnatural strength, immense destructive activity, and total single-mindedness. See archive file SCP-847-3219 for previously documented escape attempt. Upon reaching the female it is pursuing, SCP-847 will proceed to data expunged. SCP-847's only known vulnerability is high capacity electricity. Judicious application of electricity will render SCP-847 temporarily dormant. Discovery SCP-847 was discovered, apparently inert, in a remote location in the hills of the Mojave Desert on blank. A female hiker who had gone missing was discovered near the mannequin, apparently killed by massive blunt trauma. Enough evidence existed for the police to connect the killing to the mannequin. Luckily, SCP operatives caught wind of the event during the preliminary investigation, before SCP-847 had been taken from the crime scene and potentially allowed to become active. The discovery stands as a perfect example of how, and why, close adherence to public surveillance procedures is necessary for the continued success of the entire organization. Additional Data SCP-847 was originally found in a further state of disrepair. It appears to have regenerated somewhat between initial discovery and present time. It is hypothesized that the regeneration method is linked to its obsessive desire for human females. The method SCP-847 uses to detect females in such a range, even despite the containment procedures, is also as yet unknown.